Are you looking for action figures? Then head over to The Chosen Prime. The link is in the description. Just follow that. And man, they got everything your heart desires. Transformers, 5-2 toys, Power Rangers, Turtles, Marvel, DC, statues, whatever you want. Just go over and follow that link, man. You can order everything you want. Just order. Just go over there and order. Well, hey there, everybody. How y'all doing? Thank you for coming back as always. I appreciate it. I really hope you're having a wonderful day or night. And welcome back to my channel. As always, I'm Deluxe. All right, let's do another transform review. Yeah. Today I'll be taking a look at Studio Series Dinobot Slug Slag and Daniel Witwicky. All right, finally. Big shout out to my boy Trans Aaron. He finally he got a guy up in California hooked me up with this guy. And man, so, so happy to finally get this guy. Man, look at that box art. Looks so good. And you got the side. You got the side. He actually has a face. Daniel does, but it does not on the toy. But I'm sure everybody's seen this review. I mean, everybody's reviewed him already before I have. But, yeah, whatever. It is what it is. 32 steps to transform this guy. But I'm so excited to get this, man. I've messed around with him, and he is. He's pretty fun, so I really like him. So there you go. There you go. Dinos bought Slug. Slag. Everybody wants to call him Slag because that's his original name. But, you know, there's some... You know, people getting a little hissy about it. But let's just get right to the review. That's what you came for. Yeah. All right. And just like every studio series, they come with a little backdrop. This is when they're going after Cup and Hot Rod on the Quintesson planet. So there you go. Looks pretty good. It says Transformers the movie. It's got Generations up there. Looks pretty good. And he comes with uh, Daniel. So yeah, that's that's something. It's got a robot on his chest. Whoop, 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 whoop. On the box, it shows his face, but he don't have a face. I'm sure somebody will make something, a sticker or something. It just got some decent paint. You know, it's got some yellow right here. The hands are painted a, a light blue, and then it's even a lighter blue on the legs. But uh, articulation is really lacking. You can move the arms around like this a little bit in and out, but just because of uh, the ball joint. And then you got the legs look like he's uh, popping a squat all the time. He can sit on uh, slag. He can sit up here if you want. You know, you got that. And he is a retool and a repaint of wheelie. I have no idea where I put wheelie, so I can't do comparisons, but y'all know what he looks like. But my boy Firetox made some legs for him so he could actually bend, you know, and get some articulation. Tons of waffles. Mm -mm -mm. There you go. There's the back. You don't want to, so... That's Daniel, and I got some paint, whatever. But anyways, yeah, it is what it is. Blah. But there you go. That's this, and he does come with a gun. I'll show you that in a little bit. So there's all the stuff he comes with. Slag. And there you go. There's the man of the hour, Slag. And I always liked Slag. Slag was my favorite auto, uh, just Dinobot, and because um, I always loved the Triceratops. As a dinosaur, it's always my favorite dinosaur as well, and I always loved this guy. So there he is. Looks pretty good, except for this. Come on, Hasbro. What in the hell are you thinking? Really? You couldn't fill out that little gap right there on his horns? Come on now. But nice gold paint. Love the nice metallic blue for the eyes. Love that Autobot symbol. But yeah, that's, come on now. Golly, you got the gold horn. He can't open his mouth and you can put in fire, uh, you know, effects in there. Got a little stump right there. You can put that. That's nice. Lots of sculpt work, some detailed sculpt work throughout. You got some nice paint. This is the same thing as your uh, gun. It's kind of a gray paint right there. Kind of wish they would have painted some of this like gold or silver. Could have really brought out some of that stuff. But it looks really good. Nice, you know, sculpt work throughout, some line work. You got the gold up here. Once again, now you do got some ports right here and right there. If you want to put some Battle Masters or something, you can put that there too. Kind of wish they would have done this uh, in gray or something. Would have been cool. I'm sure Generation Selects or something may do like a, you know, like a silver, uh, like a, what's the word I'm looking for? I can't think of it. But, uh, you know, you know, metallic paint or something, you know, or like that. Or chrome. That's what I was thinking of. Chrome. Golly. But yeah, I'm sure Generation Selects will come along to get to do some repaints. I'll do a chrome one of that. That would have been pretty cool. Once again there. Then you got the tail gold. I wish they would have painted the weapon gold too. So kind of match up with that. That kind of, you know, it's kind of an eyesore. Then you got some big old gas back here. It is for the feet, you know, to, you know, go in there, but kind of wish they would have put something over that, you know, maybe a little something to slide over down, something like that. Nice sculpt work in here. 
as well. You got some little horns or little whatever spikes right there, not horns, spikes. And then the same thing. Head don't move. Uh, no, just a little bit with the mouth. Uh, these go up back and forth. Nicely done. Ratcheted. They do go out as well. A little bend of the foot or the ankle. You got a swivel right there too. Same thing for these back here. And then you got a bend right here, a bend right here. And that is about it for articulation. Yeah, nothing else can go on there. So there you go. Other than that, just stupid right there. And the tail, which would have been gold, so it would have matched up with that. Really nicely done, you know, really nicely done. Really. I mean, these Dinobots are turning out really good. So there you go. That is the alt mode for slag. Dinobots. And there he is next to Siege Red Alert, just for some scale reference right here. There you go. He's a big fella. Jump, jump. So there you go. That is a scale. And there he is with Grimlock, and my god, that looks so good together. Oh, I hope we get the other three, because this is turning out to be a wonderful, probably the best Dinobots in the official line, you know, the main line, has ever been put out. And this looks so good. My god, that is so awesome. Great scale. He is leader class, forgot to say that if I didn't, but he is leader class, but man. Look at all that goodness. Mm, mm, mm. God, I love that stuff, man. Man, it's great to be a Transformer collector now. There you go. He's with Grimlock. And real quick, there he is with the G1 and the G2 versions. Like I said, Generation Selects, I, I guarantee they could do a clear thing of his on the uh, his uh, faceplate right there or his head and do a chrome version. Guarantee they could do a Generation Selects for that. That'd be pretty cool. So there you go. A little G1 action for you. Crappagonis, crappy toilet paper, a bottle of aspirin, some Care Bears for scale. All right, folks, transformation time. So I had to do it this angle because um, he's a big fella. All right, first you want to do is take out his gun. And I'll show it to you real quickly. Looks good. It is painted. Very nice. I like that. Nice gray. Got some sculpt work in there. Yeah, they paint it. So that is pretty cool. All right. So first things first, you want to, he's already lifted up, so you want to take that. Now it is tabbed. There's a little tab right here and goes into that slot. There's two little slots on the side, so you are going to do that. So you just want to get this kind of out of the way. And you want to kind of combine or wars the legs out like that. And then you want to close up the legs like that. And they fit in like that. Do that. Get that out of the way. Then you want to come around. You want to move the foot down. Then you want to lift this up right here. And you just want to slide this in there. That's great. Like that. Do the same thing. Come on. There we go. It's tabbed in, so be careful. You want to do that. There you go. That is the feet. You want to turn this around 180. All right. There's that. All right. Then you want to move these out. I'm going to open up this chest. And now you got to spread these apart and get it out there. And then you got to untab these two as well, right here, so you can do this. And then let's move that like that. And it gives you enough room that you can move down this right here. And then lift up the head. Think you can lift up the head? Yep, there you go. Well, nope. Golly, come on. There we go. All right. So now you can lift up the head. Then you can close up the chest like that. And then you want to move the wings out and you want to kind of maneuver all this down like that. This is going to tab up in there. Things going to tab up in there. 
All right, I was finally able to get it. I had to take it off camera, but you can lock it into there. Got the little wings. Then you want to get the uh, last thing, you want to get the fist out and then twist them around. Do the same thing with this one, hopefully. There you go. Twist that around. And there you go. That is how you transform slag. I'm going to clean them up a little bit and I will be right back. All right, folks, back from cleaning them up. I did a little, there's a little gap in the chest. I had to close it in a little bit. So there he is holding his weapon. He can hold it in either hand. Looks good. And this little thing, if you want to, you can ride it right there. There's a hole and he's got a little peg right there. If you want to ride it, he can do that. But nobody cares. All right, looks good. I really, really like him. I'm gonna take the weapon off. Nice head sculpt. Looks really good. I like that. Nice chest. Love that Autobot symbol right there. Some sculpt work through right there. Kind of weird with these things right here. I mean, you can put them down if you want to. Look a little better. Love that metallic blue and green paint right there. Looks good. Love the gold right here. Gold paint, very nice. It's got a little backpack going on. I think it cleans up decent, you know. And you got this back here. Love how it fills out. Now you have an option. You can either have them in like that, or you can do the toy version. And basically, what you do, you open that up, and you can leave them like this. So you have that option too. So that's pretty cool. Options are always good in Transformers. So there you go. All right, let's take a look at uh, articulation, uh, head movement. You have to lift this up a little bit so you can get a little bit better head movement. Down quite a bit. Not much up side to side and a little add to as well i love that um the plastic is kind of shiny kind of looks like paint but i don't think it's painted but i love those metallic blue eyes they look really good great head sculpt i love it some sculpt work throughout here this is painted gray i like that all right so you can go all the way out to there nice ratchet wow that's awesome all the way around 90 degrees bicep swivel Swivel with the hands. The hands will look painted too. They got a nice shape. Yeah, I think they're painted gray. So they painted the hands. That's nice. Same for everything. Once again, some nice sculpt work throughout there. He does have a waist swivel. Looks good. Van Dam all day, every day. Ratcheted legs. Come on now. Kicking back. Swivel. Once again, I love that metallic paint right there. Oh, man, come on now. Some ratchet on the knees. I love some ratchet, man. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Love that. Love the scope right there. Uh, no toe tilt up or down, but he do have a rocker. It does lock in, so you got to do that. So very nice. Once again, look at the back. Freaking A, man. I love this thing. It looks good. All right. So that is articulation and scope work of slag. He's kind of doing the lean over. I think my, my service is not even, so he kind of leans over like a fat Joe. So there you go. All right, there's Optimus Prime, Retgar from the 86 movie line as well, Ironhide, and his buddy, old Wheeljack. For some scale. Man, he's a big fella. Golly, I love that. Crappagonic's crappy toilet paper, a bottle of aspirin, some Care Bears, and Squeaks for more scale. And there he is with Grimlock, and that's the money shot. Man, I can't... Oh, they better make all the five Dinobots. That's going to look so good. But these two together, freaking awesome. Love it. So there he is with Grimlock. Mm. 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 All right, folks, let's talk about some Studio Series 86 movie line, Slag. Well, they call him Slug, but everybody knows he's Slag. Man, freaking awesome. Issues I have. The horns. God dang, come on, Hasbro. Y'all better than that. I uh, wish the, gold, the gun would have been painted gold. 
kind of match up with it. Mainly have the biggest gripes in dyno mode, in which I keep them in dyno mode. That's what I like them as. But um, yeah, I mean, the gun I wish would have been maybe painted gold. Could have matched in with the tail. Um, the gaps in the back of the legs. You know, I'm sure somebody may uh, make a kit for that or something. But man, that horns, man. Come on now, Hasbro. Other than that, freaking awesome. Love the dino mode. Like I said, it's, one of my, it's my favorite dinosaur of all time. I've always, and this is my favorite dino bot. Transformation's easy and fun. Going back and forth, really nice. Bot mode looks really good. The paint on this is really good as well. Lots of sculpt work and, you know, line work. Really like that. I wish there was more of this, the metallic. Uh, green and blue. I wish we could have some, seen some more of that. The face, head sculpt looks good. The metallic eyes look really good. A gun. Uh, Daniel, piece of crap. Wish they would just gave us a sword instead of just him. Uh, that would have been better, but eh, you know, it is what it is. Uh, articulation, really good. Actually, really freaking good. You have an option to uh, do a toy mode if you want to. So yeah, very awesome. Once again, Hasbro, please, for the love of God, Give us the other three, please. I want all five of these because they are really freaking awesome. Love it. All right. I am so... Oh, what is that over there? Oh, God. Oh, no. Excuse me. Gah. Kick the baby. Kick the baby some more. Yeah, he got scared a little bit. So very nicely done, Hasbro. Y'all are doing really good with the 86 movie line. Oh, God, I hope they do a... Oh can't wait to get all this stuff all right that was my review over slag hope you liked it hit me up some likes shares prayers and care bears go ahead and hit that sub button for me if you don't mind hit me up some comments some of you thought of the review and i guess i'll see you in the next transform review and as always be good to yourself hell has bro and good night folks it's awesome i love it love it so much man gotta lick it mm. good night folks